KPU-TV, located in Ketchikan, Alaska, uses our entire island as our only studio, bringing Emmy Award-winning local television to our remote island community and the world beyond. Our small staff of two and three part-time videographers have forged highly successful community partnerships to bring over 10 locally produced shows to a town that has no other local television. 17 channels, 24-7. From live music, cooking, history, the arts, events, and our anchor show, Live in Ketchikan, KPU-TV offers a local television experience that is unheard of in a town of 14,000. Our shows highlight everything about Ketchikan that is unique, and the community are our stars. From our award-winning Ultimate Outdoor Challenge to our partnership with the Ketchikan Visitors Bureau to produce the Emmy Award-winning Ketchikan Story Project, KPU-TV takes local television to an entirely new level. KPU-TV works with countless local nonprofits and businesses to broadcast their message in Ketchikan and to the world. From our creative coverage of the Ketchikan Lumberjack shows to our broadcast of NBA Championship players' first ever Game of the Century in Ketchikan to promote autism awareness. With over 1,500 in the audience and the help of Hollywood's own Susan Santiago from The Fast and Furious, we were able to help this local organization raise over $15,000 for autism. But we didn't stop there. We also welcomed NASCAR's Danny Lasoski as we featured his efforts to help Healing Waters and everything they do for wounded warriors in Ketchikan. By actively engaging our community through our popular celebrity chef show, host LaDonna Gunderson was asked to travel to the U.S. Embassy in Oman to create a cooking experience. As a commercial salmon fisherman and cookbook author, her efforts were hugely popular with the hometown crowd on KPU-TV and to the world. Speaking of the hometown crowd, in 2015, KPU-TV, in its partnership with Ketchikan High School, was able to air live, for the first time ever, K-High Sports. Educator Bill Wicker was noted nationally for his efforts with KPU-TV and Ketchikan High School. The film students, along with KPU-TV, created a live sports channel for the community. Fellow educator Mark Woodward was named a Nat Geo Educator of the Year. From basketball, baseball, softball, debate, academic decathlon, and soccer, KPU-TV and KHI have it covered at a new level that our community never dreamt possible. Local event coverage is the bread and butter of local television. From the 4th of July to the world's shortest St. Patrick's Day parade and even a traveling circus, we're there. But KPU-TV's coverage of the first ever Race to Alaska documented the rugged and unforgiving route of 17 boats as they traveled from Port Townsend, Washington to Ketchikan, Alaska in an unassisted, no-motor boat race of over 750 miles. To the winners, $10,000 nailed to a log. And to the unlucky second place team, true to Ketchikan character, a set of steak knives. And that's not all because Ketchikan, Alaska is simply that interesting. We actively embrace our native community by covering everything from totem pole ceremonies to artists and much, much more. In 2015, KPU-TV grew beyond being totally local. With over 50,000 followers through social media, we actively engage the world by sharing our stories. Host and producer Michelle O'Brien has been the featured speaker at several national events on social media to include the 2015 Alliance for Community Media Conference in Los Angeles. And in 2015, we were part of the team that garnered their seventh Emmy for the Ketchikan Story Project. KPU-TV, winner of the 2015 Best of the Northwest for Overall Excellence in Community Media, the NTCA Overall Excellence Award for Local Television in 2015, and an award winner for the best local channel promotion from NATOA.